This dazzling display of song and dance is part of an annual world-class event held here on the historic grounds next to the Sequepnik Museum. When people come here to the Sequepnik Museum and Heritage Park, they get a very rich experience learning about the culture of our Sequepnik people. We have some artifacts here dated back to 6,000 years ago. The first phase would have been the Shushwap phase. The second phase is the Thompson Plateau phase, and the current Calypse phase is um, over 2,000 years. So we have artifacts dating back to all three of those phases. The people get a really good understanding of what the lifestyle of our people were, and which I think is very important because when they leave here, they have a better understanding of our culture. Part of that cultural understanding comes from Daniel Saul, who takes visitors on a guided tour of an ancient village. 2,000 years ago, if you were here, you'd have seen a village full of people. And you can see here, this has got two entrances. They would stay in here in the winter time, probably the end of October, whenever it got cold. The cool air, the fresh air would come in there, and because cool air is cool and it goes to the bottom, then you have your fire here. So it's causing a draft, so you, you're actually making the, causing the smoke and the stale air to go out. Generally, they slept on, on a flat area with their sleeping mat. Thousands of years have passed, many perilous, but the Sequetmic people and their culture have survived. 